going to listen to Mount Kimby. Uh, I thought it was Kimball until recently, but it's Kimby, The Sunset Violet. Always the Bridesmaid, never the Bride. I've always quite liked their albums, but they've never turned into favourites of the year. But this is a cracker and a really, really good listen. Enjoy. Track one, The Trial. Uh, strong, strong opener. Um, I mean, they're an indie band, certainly. They've got an electronic feel to them, maybe like Tame Impala, but I find them a little bit more interesting than Tame Impala. But if you like that sort of thing, it's a cracking album, good start. Track two, dumb guitar. Um, metronomy is another sort of comparison in a way. Disappointing for me, after such a strong opener in the trip, I think it was. This to me is just sort of shoegazery, tame parlory again, middle of the road, not Track three, shipwreck. It's very Mount Kimby that I like one track a lot and then don't like one, and but I do like this. It's a uh, very new ordery in its delivery. Could be an early new order song, which is a big compliment. Um, yeah, can't say fairer than that. Track four, Boxing with King Cruel. I've never really got on with King Cruel. Nothing changed my mind here, but it does later. There's a track with him that I do like. Uh, and then we've got Got Me at number five. It is. I, I don't like a track, and I like a track. This is a, it's only a build-up track, but it's a really interesting, strong build. Track six, A Figure in the Surf. Uh, I've liked two tracks in a row. I do like this track. It might be my favourite. It's certainly up there. It's sort of got a Fleetwood Mac feel to it, sort of an 80s drive, like you're getting in, a, in an old 80s film with cars and aeroplanes. Track seven, Fish Brain, much better title for a song than the actual song, which uh, is not a low light for me, I'm afraid. Doesn't do an awful lot. Um, just sort of plugs, plods away, but it's cool. You know, it's called Fish Brain. It's a cool title. Very, very, very good title indeed, but not cool. Uh, track eight, Yucca Tree, Bullshit Gazing, not over-inspired, but I do like the last track an awful lot. Um, I've never really got on, I never really understood King Cruel, but this, I sort of get him and I get them, and it really works together. I think by far the strongest track on the album. Really good. Overall review of Mount Kimby, the Sunset Violet, is it's so close to being really, really good. The first and the last track, the bread of the sandwich is the best quality bread ever. But the ingredients, some are brilliant, some are really, really nice, and then you just get the odd one that just ruins the flavour.